<sighs> fuck. Hello, my fellow peeps and crownies. It is time. I already got so goddamn excited for this video that I broke a goddamn light bulb searching for an SD card for you little fuckers. So let's see what we got in the limited games run. I'm gonna be honest with you. I, I'm kind of retarded. Jack and Dexter Collector's Edition. Money shot. Oh, cool, dude. You sent me a bunch of fucking playing cards. Uh, oh. Uh, oh, my God. What a f absolutely beautifully flawless game. I cannot tell you why I think this game is so goddamn flawless, unlike my camera focus. Let's set that big boy to the side. Wow, that's shitty bubble wrap. I have never, ever ordered anything from Limited Runs, so this is gonna be a first impression on their part as well. So, here we have some cards, I guess, some <laughs> limited cards. How does this work? So we go one, two, that one, three. That one, two, three to the front, and we get rid of the fighting energy. I've not seen that! Samson Oak? Is this a black Professor Oak? And ooh, what's this? Ooh, two ninety eight. It's a bunch of um. All right, and then we have the dynamic duo, the boys that possessed my childhood since <clears throat> I put my hands on a PlayStation Two controller. I don't think I've ever seen them in this stance before, so that's pretty one of a kind, pretty unique, very very pretty. It's got a giant orb background. Shines pretty nice. I really like this wallpaper. And then, oh, well, would wow, wow, would you would you look at that? If it isn't an astronaut, oh god, what's the Space Ranger game? Space Ranger game, game that goes, psh, psh, and it's it's a fucking, it's like a Halo, but it's not Halo, but it is Halo. And okay, I just I don't know what what is up with these cards. I got the Jack and Dexter Collector's Edition. I got a bunch of crap from whatever. I don't even know what this is. Am I supposed to know what this is? Oh, oh, I guess it's from this. Headlander. This adult swim game. I did not ask for this. I, why would I want this game? I don't, this is stupid. This is not, why would I ask for that? I hate that. <clears throat> this is what I asked for. This is exactly what I asked for. Nah, I have to open it. I have to open it. I gotta open all this. Oh, look, it even says limited runs right on the, <laughs> on the, <laughs> on the, <laughs> I promised you guys, I don't think anyone saw the comment, but I promised you guys I would open, do a official opening for all you poor people out there who couldn't afford this. So let's see what we got inside. <gasps> Ooh, nutting already. Do we just have one disc? We do. Okay. That's beautiful. Oh, it smells. Oh, it smells like a peanut factory. Oh, is this? Oh my god, I hope this is exactly. I hope this is exactly what I think it is. Oh my god, thank you. Thank you, Limited Runs game. You've officially restored my childhood with this map. Oh my god, it's so beautiful, so elegant everything I've ever wanted. I may like this part a little more than others and I'll explain in a sec. Pretty cool little map thing we got going on here. All right, keep that just fucked off over there. And then uh, this can go right there. Yeah, cool, sweet. All right, next we have this. This is the shirt that came with it. Right, ooh, this is already looking super badass. Oh yeah, oh that's gorgeous oh i feel so certified so privileged so oh i just want to oh god i love this so much <laughs> all right now i know what you guys are thinking i want the big boy i want the big meat the dessert well i have it for you here it is the official part that we all asked for there we go. 
Thank you, keys. Why don't you just get a knife? I don't fucking, I don't want to get a knife. I don't have a knife. I'm not a man. Ooh, oh my god. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, this is just a, oh, I thought this was actually on it. This is just a, a bleh. So it's actually on the back. Okay, so we got a little naughty dog stamp of approval. You guys should say, tell me in the comments how you think Limited Runs ran this whole thing. They still have the Jack 2 collector's editions that I wasn't able to get my hands on because I was just like, more fucking money. Um, and the Jack 3, and I believe they're going the Jack X all the way to X. They're really milking this thing. But uh, let me know down in the comments what you guys, what you guys think Limited Runs games um, how they handled this whole process. M -m -m money shot! Oh my god! Ooh, now that's a good smell. So, oh my god, this is already gorgeous. So we have this Jack and Dexter design bible. That is looking pretty, pretty slick. Delicious. And then, what was this supposed to be? I forgot what the, is this supposed to be a USB stick? Or, huh, I don't know. But, that looks pretty cool. It's got memory card on the back with the naughty dog paw that's pretty cool set that to the side this is exactly what i wanted this entire time oh my god my own precursor orb it almost looks like you can open it it's not looking like it Whew. that's actually not that heavy about the size of a filled easter egg with say about half pound of granted weed now we have oh okay there's stuff behind it it's gonna fall okay just gonna put it that there so i guess this is a second game why would they give me two jack and dexters for the ps4 this seems a little silly seems a little hmm oh look at that it's another it's the same thing you get the same map in the same game why did i buy this twice I know there's something about a mock case. Maybe the other one's a mock case, but why does it just come with... By purchasing all four games, it doesn't matter if it's the standard edition or collectors, limited run games will gift you a mock case of Jack 4? What? The mock case will include a code redeemable for a PlayStation 4 system theme based on Naughty Dog's original late OO Jack 4 concept art. There will be no other way to acquire this item outside of this, so make sure to order all four of our releases if you want to own it. Hello, Editing John here, and to the following clip that you just saw, I thought this was the mock case that they were talking about, but it's really not looking like it at all. Apparently you have to buy all four collector's editions to get the mock case. Then what is this? What actually is this? Did I literally just buy Jack and Dexter twice? I did, here's the thing, I did find out something interesting about this little cover art for the case. So, if you take your case and you open it up, you can see that the paper for it, oh look at that, it's the same thing on the inside. You can just flip it invertedly and get a whole new case. And the other uh, Jack and Dexter physical copy that I got, it has uh, this side on the other side as well. So I literally did just buy two Jack and Dexters, two Jack and Dexter physical copies. I was really hyped to be getting the uh, dynamic theme for PlayStation 4, but I guess never, never mind. I guess you have to buy all four? This, this shit's just straight confusing. Uh, anyway, back to the video. Yeah, that's a big poster. I don't, I don't feel like opening that up right now. Let me get through everything in here first. Oh my gosh. It just keeps coming. Damn, they packed this thing. Hey, there's me. <laughs> but here we have the Jack and Dexter original soundtrack, first ever on a disc. Centennial Beach, Sandover Village, all the way to, there's three parts of the lava tube, I guess. The Citadel. Cutscene underscore one, cutscene underscore, all the way through to six. An unused, there, ooh, there's a bunch of unused, well, not a bunch, there's an unused forest theme and an unused unsnowy mountain. And we looks like we got a couple demos right here as well. That's pretty, pretty dope. Thank you, Mark Mothersburg, Mothersbog, and Josh Mansell. You guys 
played the st the strings and keys of my childhood. You know your boy's gotta open this too though, right? When are we gonna run out of plastic? Like seriously, like how much plastic can we just keep making? Like what even is plastic made out of? I'm sure it's such a, just a Google search away, but whatever. Ooh, those are some interesting artwork designs. So this is disc one. Okay, so there's a couple discs. Does it open like, okay. Oh, it's always scary when people do discs like this because sometimes they just break. Sick, I'm gonna bump that in my fucking car. And now we have a, f a Jack and Dexter official trading card. I don't know if I wanna open this. I don't know if I wanna open. Yeah, I'm just messing with you. I'm gonna open it. All right, come on, come on, baby. So, okay, we're just gonna we're just gonna go through them. There we have the mysterious, sexy incest kids, Gull and Maya. Our fan favorite Dexter with a weird jawline. The cutie cutie Kira. The master of Green Eco, Samos. And Jack and Dexter behind a precursor dildo, a surfboard. I really don't know what the hell that is. That's interesting. There's a big fucked off orb. There's the whole gang posing together. Not like they had cameras in their era. And there's the boys right at the end, this last card. <coughs> Here's the poster from earlier that you get inside the collector's edition. Uh, box thing. I don't even know what the hell to call it, but yeah, it looks pretty dope. I will definitely get a frame or something for it. That is amazing. So I wanted to explain the map thing real quick. Why uh, why it's so significant? And I'm glad I got well, actually two now. Like I said, I was a child when I got this game, and sadly, all that remains of my map from PlayStation 2. This is all I have. <laughs> I was so sad, I have no idea, I guess I got mad at the game or something, ripped it in half. You guys like Sly Cooper? And here, since we're on the topic of Jack and Dexter, I do actually have my original Jack and Dexter disc from PlayStation 2 I got back from 19, uh, 19 no, 2001, maybe 2000, the year 2000. And if we look real closely in the center, kind of cracked in a few spots, and now for the real embarrassment, uh, it might be hard to see with the angles and all that, but this thing is super scratched. Like, I, I am so surprised it even runs, because I'll tell you what, it still runs, somehow. It just, it just works. Oh, and you thought we were done there, right? Wrong. We still have this to go through. I'm curious, I'm curious. Kind of feels like a Dr. Seuss book. Original production binder. Okay, so what is this? Following note notebook pages were taken from our project binders. Each was assembled by hand and provided to each member of the team. They were coveted by many, but lost by few. I am fortunate to have a complete copy of every project that started the world. Oh, started the word, Jack. Maybe except that one. What? <laughs> blah, blah, blah. Okay, I'm not gonna read this here. I'm gonna put this like perfectly so. And you can go ahead and pause and read through it if you're that interested. I just, I'm, oh, oh, wow. A whole table of contents. All right, I'm just gonna kind of skim through it. Racing goggles, action. You know, for giving these both racing goggles, I feel like there wasn't that much racing in the game to like consider them racers at first. Maybe Jack 2, they really exploited that, but, oh wait, oh his name's not Gull. <laughs> it's Evil Brother. Hmm, minor, sage, Sage's assistant? I thought that was his daughter. <laughs> oh, it's okay, it says that it's his daughter, but. I guess, well, I guess these are just, you know, they're starting character names. They didn't, like, solidify who's who yet. Yo, is this, is this, uh, Gyarados? Is this Gyarados over here? Is that my man Gyarados? 
definitely some interesting designs they got going on here for all the vehicles, the technology, the robots. You know, they really went through it all before putting it together, and I very much enjoy that. I appreciate it. If only they could just, you know, do it again for Jack 4. Was it that hard to pretty much accidentally make Game of the Year only because you didn't want to continue with what could have been Game of the Century? <laughs> Naughty Dog really had their head up their ass that year. I'll tell you what. Here's a big old thank you page from John Fairhurst, CEO of Limited Games, even though I don't really care about you. And ooh, this is a very seductive pose by Jack and Dexter on a, I, yeah, that definitely looks like a surfboard. I don't know why there, there's a surfboard. There was never a time that they went surfing or any really beach related activities in the game but there it is that's the entire Jack and Dexter collector's edition it took six it took half a year for me to get this that is truly disgusting truly retarded oh but hold on gamers that's not just quite it we're gonna take a dive and, and see maybe what maybe if this is a little different than the actual game than than the other you know three times that I've already Bought in this game. All right, so we're just gonna we're gonna take this disc out. What is this? What does that say? Oh, oh my God! Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, kids. Yeah, okay, so we're just gonna see. We're just gonna pop that bad boy right in. So, right away we get a message saying a download version of the same application has already been installed. Do you want to start using the disc version of it? If you do so, the download version will be deleted but you can continue to use save data and add-ons. What kind of bullshit is that? So is this really just gonna load the same way? I thought this was gonna be at least a little different, but I am a true fan. I do have, I did got that whole collection and I've already beaten the game twice on the, the digital version and I was working on a third one, so it's going to be really annoying if it's doing all this copy update file shit and then I get into it and it's all gone. That part always gave me a freaking heart attack as a kid. I never knew when it was going to come. Hey, okay, so it, it, it saved all my shit. That's good. But... Ugh. I just really wanted something new. I just bought a copy-pasted game so many times and now I just I just get to live with that? You think I just get to accept that? You think Jack and Dexter would accept that? Do you think Jack would accept Mar would accept buying the same thing three times as you, you advertise it as different? Maybe they didn't advertise it as different and I'm just being dramatic, but... God, such a great game. But, um, I'll make a quick little plug right here. I'll put a link on this video. This is exclusive to the boys on the Jack and Dexter Eco posting uh, Facebook page, but I'll leave a link to, I have a YouTube channel called um, Variation Art. I'm thinking I'm gonna be soon changing the name to the official Suck. I just, I love that name so much better. Uh, if you want to check me out there, I do tons and tons of different types of uh, videos over there and I'm planning on releasing a bunch of content on that channel soon. My stomach is telling me I need to diarrhea because I am beyond excited that I got to open all this but my stomach's very upset that I didn't use the bathroom before opening all of it. So that being said, thank you guys for watching and Naughty Dog I know you're fucking listening to me you better make a jack for right fucking now before I shit all over into a fucking mail all in your all your mailboxes and send 20 fucking letters to every single one of the people who works there and shit now on your mouth just give me jack for